now we're into the stretch of games where the only way to see anything from the games is from other channels whether they're condensed versions of the game or like this video this is from the women's basketball alliance youtube channel shout out to them at least this is one of the funny goofy announcers games for the hawkeyes your usual starting lineup clark marshall Lost my train of thought there with Kate Martin, Warnock, and Sonano, and Hawks control the tip, and we're underway. Down and low to Sonano. Looks for cutters, lobs it back out to Clark. Clark, little give and go. Steps around the Sonano screen, fade away. Rims out. Finley drives to the hoop. Mar Martin cuts her off. Clark on green, pull up jumper. Back rim, Clark with the rebound. Hawks on the run, Clark in the open floor, goes to the left hand, can't get around Green. Can't do it. Dumps it to Sonano, has to regroup, little pull up, she's fouled. That she has a post advantage, especially they'll feel that tonight. Sonano gets the first, and Sonano is just so good on the block. Makes the second. Marshall, good transition defense there, stops her attack, pull up three. Back rim. Sonano, long rebound. Clark now. McDermott can make those shots. If she can get going, that'll definitely lead to you and I being in this game. A couple times this season's hit five threes in a game, and, and not on high-volume shooting. Uh, under, under ten shots a game from three-point range. Clark misses the first. She's an 86% free-throw shooter on her career. Gets the second. McDermott, hands off. You'll see this play a lot. Buffelli gets the left-handed layup to go. 3-2 Iowa leads. Prototype power forward right there, mobile and able to just back people down. Perfect give and go from the Hawkeyes. Martin fed the post to Sonano. Sonano dumped it to Martin, finished with the left hand. Hawks have their first bucket, 5-2. I think that's where the pace of play that Iowa has is going to help them out, you and I, as Finley just hits a bomb right there. Finley went over under the screen when Martin ducked under. Same play, Gabby Marshall this time. Works like a charm. Martin slow to get up there. I'm sorry, Marshall slow to get up. Buffelli. Kate Martin says not today. You know, maybe you could try that around the corner, but not Kate Martin's house. After the last Hawkeye game, she was uh, she was down and maybe looked to be out for a while, but McDermott steps around, gives it back. Buffelli for three. Back rims. Good hustle from Green, gets the rebound. McDermott for three. Deep. Green with another offensive rebound and scores. Sonano, sick of handing off, takes the dribble, kicks it back out. Warnock for three. Back rim. Green with another rebound. Finley with Clark on her now. Step back three, left-hander. Short this time. Clark gets the roll out to half court. Pulls up for three herself. That's no. Molly Davis tried to run it down. She checked in for Gabby Marshall earlier. McDermott on the move. Steps right around Clark and scores. 9-7, you and I. One of the smaller players out there. Just no one there. No one home. I mean, must have been some miscommunication for the Hawkeyes there. Sonano spins to the right, scores. First free throw is long. Shoot about 56% as a team. 59, excuse me. We watched them shoot in pregame. They were really good at that corner three. Only missed about two in the pregame. Clark gives to Warnock. Clark beats. Hawkeyes are doing a great job of sharing the ball around. Long three. Lobby misses. Kate Martin goes and gets the rebound. Fox on the push. Clark thought about pulling up. Warnock for three. Got it. First three of the game for the Hawks. Timeout, Coach Ward, and you and I. McDermott's back in. She'll bring the ball up the floor. Iowa stays in the zone. Stelke in the game now for the Hawks. Buffelli at the high post again. McDermott for three. 
She got that one. One player you have to worry about when you're in zone. She got overcommitted there. Clark kicks it to the corner for Martin three. Well long. Rebound to Buffelli. Buffelli wants to give it up. Marshall's not letting her give it to McDermott. Finally does. Went for the wraparound steal. Doesn't work. Five quick points for McDermott. You and I right back to the lead. 15-14. Clark skipped pass to Stelke. Does a good job stopping Martin mid-range. Gets that one. Loving the aggressiveness of Kate Martin tonight. Finley with Marshall checking her. Good contested shot, but it goes in. Finley. Clark, little fade. Off the rim. Good back cut from Green. You and I is really bringing it to them, and Hawkeyes haven't answered fully on the effort side. Step back three from McDermott. Well long, but another offensive rebound. Buffelli scores. She does rely on her athleticism a lot. I think that burned the Hawkeyes right there. Clark mid-range. Got it. Finley on the drive. Comes back to the left hand, tries to step through, frees herself up. Kate Martin with the rebound. Green's going to check Clark. She just slow dribbles now, starts to back in. Warnock. Clark gets all the way to the hoop. Blocked by Green. Great defense. McDermott gets free. That's late. It almost goes in. Would not have counted. So for them to be up by eight early, six offensive rebounds, only have five second chance points off of that. But if it continues, the Hawkeyes can really get burned by that. Gabby Marshall long on the air ball. Really be nice to see her kind of almost a... Ooh. Tough call there on Kate Martin as she fouls McDermott on the drive to the hoop. Going to need her to find her rhythm. McDermott makes the first. Just two and a half rebounds a game. Defense not where it needs to be right now. Marshall to Warnock. Steps all the way in the lane. Buffelli, high screen. McDermott picks up her dribble. Green with it now. Marshall, good defense on her on the switch. Sinano. A Fulter on Lobby. That's just good work from Buffelli. Already five fouls called in less than three minutes. They're, they're, they're getting a little whistle happy right now. Clark lobs at the corner for Marshall. Clark, step back three. Rattles at home. Only takes one. Kaitlyn Morgan tries to power her way through Caitlin Clark. Good defense. Caitlin Clark with a rebound. Steps around Morgan on the push. Try to do everything she can. You know, it doesn't, not even just the players on the court, though. It, the, the energy feels like everyone's walking on eggshells. Clark gets them both. Yeah, you think if the Hawks swing the ball around, they should be able to find Sonano on the block. She's working on Wolf right now. Marshall for three. There it is. Hands it back to McDermott. Step back. Thought she was going to take the three. Didn't do it. Can't do it. Warnock with a steal. Tries to find some space. Finds Molly Davis for three. Hawks are on fire. 31-25. Oh, we'll see Molly Davis again. Rims that one out. Good box out there. Rebound goes to Goble. McDermott pushing up. Got Marshall. She is quick. Defensively today, she has 11 already. Has been getting to the paint consistently for someone that height. Emerson Green with a steal. More of a ball defense than his own, just attacking the ball instead of sitting in your certain coverage. They're trying to trap a lot here without Caitlin on the court. You're not really worried about someone being wide open like that. Oh, Grady fouled from behind by Buffelli. So it'll be very interesting, 4-3. 426 remaining in the half. You got to save her for when it matters more. But if the Hawkeye starts to go on a run, you have to say, you have to forget that. Pulls it back up. Pull up three. Short. O'Grady. Rebound, left hand score. Hawks finally get their own on. First offensive rebound of the game for the Hawkeyes. And that's why offensive rebounds are so big. O'Grady with a great foot back there. Good switch back on defense there from the Hawkeyes. O'Grady. Oh, what a late whistle. Coach Bluter trying to, as you watch what the referee just gestured to Coach Bluter, made that motion down. Hawks slow off the rebound there. 
Hard left-handed drive, flips it up, scores. Cam Finley with eight. Hawkeyes struggling to guard those dribble drive opportunities. 20 points in the paint now. Caitlin Clark gets fouled away from the ball. Now she'll go shoot two. And the second. Goble drives to the hoop. Short. Warnock out to Clark. Hawks on the move. Behind her back. Free Hawkeye in front of her, every Panther in front of her, and trying to make the best decision and going to the line for two. Wouldn't it surprise me to see her kick that to Marshall? See if they can create some separation. Bobs it down low. Green catches it. She traveled. All of a sudden, two people were in her face. That's that's always going to get your feet moving a little quick. Sonano down low. Scores. Foul. Hawkeyes have to take advantage. Hadela already played more minutes in this first half than she averages on the year. Hadela's having to play due to foul trouble to Wolf and Buffelli. So you got to attack those uh, near the end of the bench players when they're in the game. She pulls for three, though. Rattles it home. Yeah, she, but she adds something offensively. You know, that's the, that's the dichotomy of it. She can spread the floor a little bit better than Wolf, but her defending isn't as on par as you would like. Clark couldn't finish on Green. McDermott kicks it out. Long three, Lobby. Got it. Just when the Hawkeyes look like they could put away you and I, you and I answers back. Sonano, quick double comes. Warnock thought about the three. Short. That's going to go on Clark again. Never shying away from the contact. She's always bringing 100% effort forward. And both of them have been on screens. That one back rims out. A Poulter gets it. Hawks will probably look for a quick two for one here. Marshall for three. Got it. Gabby Marshall. Great repositioning there by Marshall. She circles up to the top when she see Caitlin gets into the paint. Right there, McDermott fell asleep on defense, led to Marshall getting that wide open look. Hawks weren't quite quick enough to get the two for one. Just a small difference in the game clock and shot clock. Hawks forced a turnover, though. When you get so close there, you're thinking, yeah, we didn't get the perfect two for one, but we gave the other team just enough time to make a mistake. Hawks tried to hustle Molly Davis up to the scorer's table, missed it. Three to shoot. Clark corner three. Gabby Marshall. Air balls that one, and that'll be the that'll end the first half.